Hello everyone and welcome to IEM Labs. Now in this tutorial, I shall give you a brief introduction on the list data structure in Python and how to add elements to a list in Python. Now the agenda of today's tutorial is to learn what is a list and how to create and manipulate a list in Python. Now to start off with what is a list, a list in Python is a linear mutable data type. Uh, by linear, I mean that a contiguous memory location is allocated whenever we declare a list and mutable means that we can change and manipulate any and every element in a list in Python. Now list is an inbuilt data type in Python that is we do not have to import any other module externally to work with lists. List can contain objects of any data type in it. It can contain integers, it can contain floats, it can even contain lists within itself. So that is uh, an advantage of a list in Python. That is we can use any and every data type in a list within Python. Now to create a list, first we need to open the Python IDLE. And as you can see, I have opened a test.py IDLE. And to create a list, we need, let's say L, we name the list as L and within third brackets, we write one, two, three and four. And let's say uh, cat 2.25 and let's say add a tuple three, four and five. So we have got a total of seven elements within the list. Now, if we want to print the number of elements, we need to simply write print len. Uh, len is an inbuilt function of a list. Uh, I'm sorry, is an inbuilt function in Python using which we can find out the length of any string, list, dictionary, uh, tuple, etc. in Python. Now, if we save and run this pro uh, module, we will get seven, which is the number of elements present inside the list. Now, let's say we want to add the number 10 to the end of the list. So how do we do that? We do it by L dot append within parenthesis 10. Now, if we print L, let's save it and run it. Now, if we print L, we will get 1, 2, 3, 4, cat 2.25, the tuple 3, 4, 5, and within and at the end of the list, we will get the extra number 10. Now, this don't get confused by this 7, it was the length of the original list that we have written here. I shall comment it out so that you do not get any confused. Let's save it and run it again. And we see that 10 has been added to the end of the list. Now, let's say, now we know that the current list is, I'm sorry, one, two, three, four, cat, 2.25, 3, 4, 5, and 10. Now, this is the current list that we have after adding 10 to the end of the original list. Now, if we want to add 1.25 between 2.25 and the tuple 3, 4, 5, what do we do? As you can see that the position of 2.25, rather the index, of 2.25 is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So the index for 2.25 is 5. Therefore, the index for 1.25 should be 6. Therefore, we can insert 1.25 after 2.25 in the list using the inbuilt insert command. Now, insert is Inbuilt is an inbuilt function for list data st uh, structure in Python. So L dot insert 1.25. That is the element we are trying to insert. 
comma 6 that is the index at which we are trying to insert the element now if we print l let's save and run it oh i am sorry the first is uh, the first argument is the index at which we are trying to insert and the second argument is the element that we are trying to insert so if we save and run it and we get 1.25 inserted after 2.25 so this is how you can add any element at the end or between any two elements in the list in python so thank you for watching this video guys uh, please do like share and subscribe to this channel and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you get notified of any and every video that we post in this channel thank you